everyone, today we are at Zoo Nigara or Malaysia National Zoo and we did our standard operating procedure already and now we are going to buy a ticket. Zoo Nigara or National Zoo is located on 110 acres of land in Puluklam, Gumbak District of Silangor, Malaysia. It was officially opened on 14th of November 1963. I'm really excited to see what kinds of animals they have inside and I'm going to make a virtual tour. So please guys stay with me until the end. Feature exhibits are Giant Panda Conservation Center, Butterfly Garden, Hornbell Center, Reptile House, Malaysian Elephants, Lake Birds, Bird Aviary, Australian Plain, Humboldt Penguin, Children's World, Bear Complex, Savannah Walk, Tipuputamus, Mamal Kingdom, Tunku Abdul Rahman Aquarium, Cat Walk and Ape Center. Zonigara is home to 5,137 animals of 476 different species. Children's World is a place where you can let your young ones run around the place while getting their senses stimulated. It is a place where your child or children pet the deer, goats, and miniature horses.
It is an honor for Zunigara to announce to everyone that the Children's World upgraded one of its corners known as the cave to attract the curious mind of both adults and the young ones. This park is managed by a non-governmental organization known as the Malaysian Zoological Society. For funding, Zunigara relies on gate collections and on support from donors and sponsors. Nile hippopotamus live in slow-moving rivers and lakes in Africa. They are known to be even more aggressive than the African crocodiles. Zunigara received MS certification in July 2007 and is a member of the Southeast Asian Zoos Association. Out of eight species of bears in the world, you get to see three species of bears Asiatic black bear, brown bear, and Malayan sun bear. Without touring around the world to see them, the bear complex is where you can find these animals if you are a bear lover.
They are open daily from 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. and last admission at 4 p.m. And of course, this zoo is wheelchair friendly. Located outside the Bird of Yari live a group of wallabies and also one of Australia's famous icon, the kangaroo. The wallabies share the same exhibit with a flock of emos, Australia's largest bird. The zoo is also home to paddy melons, the smallest of the marsupials that they have in the zoo. These timid animals are located next to the reptile house.
Savanna Walk is the largest open concept exhibit in the zoo. It's a home shared by a variety of African animals like sable antelopes, skim matter horned oryx, giraffes, ostrich, zebras, and the white rhinoceroses. And it feels like you're in South Africa. The Ape Center is situated at the highest point of Zunigara. There you get to see the group of chimpanzees from Africa and two species of orangutans, Bornean orangutans and Sumatran orangutans. The Ape Center has an open concept enclosure which allows the apes to roam freely. With lush greenery all around, the Ape Center is one of the coolest and scenic locations in the zoo. Chimpanzees share nearly 98.8% of our human DNA, which explains why they look and behave like humans. If you spend most of your day up to the ape center observing these animals, you will see them kissing, shaking hands, and sometimes even bickering among each other. Located near the Ape Center is the Giant Panda Conservation Center and you can see this cute and lovely panda bears. They love to eat bamboos and they eat this like eating sugar cane.
They also have a butterfly garden, honeybees, snake corner, penguins. Uh, but today they are temporarily closed so maybe I can make a part 2 of virtual tour in this uh, Malaysian National Zoo. Zunigara's retail house has both indoor and outdoor exhibits. They also display a variety of tortoises, terrapins, and lizards. Say hi to the world's second largest tortoise, all the Aldebaran tortoise. Meet the largest crocodile in the world, the saltwater or eastern crocodiles lazing in their pool. Zunigara's bird aviary has one of the biggest collections of bird species in the country. Also, you can enjoy the nature's music orchestra produced by different birds as you take a walk down at the bird aviary. The Tunku Abdul Rahman Lake, which sits in the middle of Zunigara, is home to over 300 free roaming birds, painted storks, ibises, egrets, swans, and pelicans, make their home on the two islands in the middle of the lake. And now we are in the Big Cats Territories.
the lions are inside the den so we are not lucky to take a video of them but looking forward to do a party virtual tour so we could see what we missed today i hope you enjoyed my virtual tour here in zunigara malaysia thank you so much guys i hope to see you on my next vlog bye